so amazing is the moonlight that makes me wonder why we separated or am i faded you shine so bright it's an understatement single is overrated if you get so close my baby might let you sing me hey guys welcome back to my channel welcome back happy april today is the second day of april and i am super excited for this month i'm excited for quarter two quarter one was sort of a test run you know trying to see how things are going to go so q2 is the thing is the time we're going to do the things we said we were gonna do this year yeah so i'm super excited that it's the new month and i feel super charged i feel um ready i feel happy i feel content and all of that thing and i hope that energy vibrates over to you and i hope you have the most amazing month ever so yeah so today being the second day of the month I am doing a lot of reset in fact this whole week is a reset so i decided to do a reset vlog so this is going to be a new month reset vlog i'm going to bring you guys along my new month reset so i will be sharing very many things maintenance organizing cleaning self-care cooking all those things that you guys love a grocery haul maybe at the end we will see but today specifically i want to organize my kitchen my cleaning lady came yesterday she comes every monday she came yesterday and she cleaned all my utensils i asked her to take them off the shelves and clean them nicely so they are all dry i need to organize the kitchen i also need to make my bed i need fresh linen and i also need to finish taking a class oh i have actually been taking a class on skillshare and i'm going to share more about it in a few seconds or minutes yeah but that's about today and then tomorrow i am going to get my hair done so i undid my hair that's why i'm still in my bonnet even though it's 2 p.m in the afternoon <laughs> I am actually still in my 90s today was like an off day kind of vibe so yeah cool chill cozy vibes over here yeah so tomorrow i'm going to get my hair done i'm actually going to get my locks done again but as i have mentioned i'm going to bring you guys along yeah i also need to get my new set for the month so this is the set i've had for the month of march yeah so i need to get my new set for april i don't know what i'll go with but we will see that tomorrow i'll definitely go on pinterest and find a cute design i really really loved this one and shine nails delivered i'm going to leave his uh page in the description box so that you guys can book for your maintenance but yeah that's just about today i have a live to join at 3 p.m currently it's 2 p.m i have a live to join by the social insider if you don't follow her what are you doing especially if you are a content creator talking of the social insider she has really been challenging me on you know doing the most with my platforms and you know curating content that resonates with my audience i've really learned so much from her and from that i am now starting to see ways that i can introduce some side hustles or at least some business aspects to my content creation journey i am trying to see ways that i can earn more and make more money online and that means i need to start businesses off of what i already do and because i feel like i have sort of mastered content creation there's a way that i can now start introducing some businesses so that i can make more money and get in my bag <laughs> <laughs> yeah that is that is if if in 2024 getting in the bag is not one of your goals then we need to drop you off now and then we can pick you up in 2025 okay i am really intentional about building another income stream so that you know we can get in a bag make some money and then create the life that we love yeah and talking of creating a business thank you so much skillshare for sponsoring today's video skillshare is the largest online learning community with thousands of classes in a wide variety of topics think photography videography 
drawing, content creation, content writing, interior design, AI, marketing, productivity. You can find classes on Skillshare touching on all these topics. Skillshare has been really integral in my self-improvement journey and in this quarter two that we are just starting, I am really intentional on building a side hustle that I can sustain. So I went on Skillshare to find a class that can help me and motivates me as I start on this journey to building an additional source of income for myself and I came across this class build your dream business craft your purpose and online presence by isis brianna brianna is a marketing consultant and in this class she talks about how you can build your dream business online by first understanding your audience in that particular class i learned that it's important for me to figure out my target audience my target segment and my ideal client that way i am selling to the person i want to buy my products she she also talks about building your promise and your messaging which is a key element of you reaching your ideal customer and making sure you convert those sales another thing that i loved about this class is how she talks about the channels you need to use for your content so that you can reach your audience in the best way she talked about the different channels that you can use for social media to create content and to share ideas with your customer and to also show them what you bring to the table and that really stuck with me if building a business was one of your goals this year and you're ready to kickstart and build this dream business of yours i highly recommend you check out this class the thing that i loved so much about this class is that she shares a workbook that you can use to complete exercises that will help you find your brand message she also talks about why you need to learn the needs and desires of your ideal audience so that you craft your content to reach them so make sure you check out this class if you are starting a business and you don't know how to show up online for your business and you're looking for ways to build a side hustle that you can sustain the class has practical tips that you can implement and get on your way to building your dream business the first 500 people to use my link in the description will receive a one month free trial of skillshare get started today watching the live and I'm getting ready to go outside for my walk and as usual I have to reapply my sunscreen even though the sun is almost going down but I have to reapply because yeah <laughs> I need to protect my skin and now my sunscreen is not coming out <laughs> let me apply the body one first as I wait for that one to come down so for my body I use the Bondi Sans one that I got from Beauty Square 
and for my face i use the nivea sun uh uv face shine control i love it because it has a mattifying effect yeah so i'm going to apply this on my on my hands especially because i'm trying to clear the hyperpigmentation on my arms as you can see my arms are really really dark and i want them to match my face and the rest of the body yeah so i'll actually carry a jacket i feel like i have a sore throat coming through so i need to stay warm but yeah uh, i just need to apply a bit of that on my face i love the way this sunscreen melts into my skin so quickly and considering i have oily skin it's really really good that's it some aremis for my lips and then i need to wear my shoes today i have these nikes that i got from planet shoes as well i get my sport shoes from them they have a nice high quality thrifted pieces they are quite pricey because some sneakers go for from i think they sell from 3500 but they are usually original sneakers so like this is a proper nike sneaker and it's so so comfortable especially for walking it's a low heel one so i like to alternate between this and my adidas my adidas are outside <laughs> they were washed yesterday so yeah today i'm gonna wear this wear on a jacket and then go outside for a walk once we come back i am going to organize the kitchen i was gonna do my hair i was going to wash my hair from home and do all that deep treatment whatever but i've decided i won't do it because tomorrow i'm going to the salon and i'll be charged still and then yeah or even i can even just go however whatever and then i'll do all those treatments with my hair locked up because i usually just do that even when i have locks yeah but for now let's go for a walk and then i will be back to organize my house a bit and then do maybe just take a shower chill i don't think i'll have dinner maybe a fruit or a salad or some nuts something and call it a night yeah but i definitely do need this walk i feel like it's a nice way of you know helping me feel better because i'm quite overwhelmed to say the least because it's the beginning of the month and i feel like i need to be doing so many things that i haven't already started yeah so i want to yeah get that walk in it really helps me so much when i go outside and just walk and see people and see trees <laughs> and breathe in fresh air it helps a lot yeah so let me wear my shoes i will talk to you guys once i get back And they needed the compliment But isn't it sickening You can say you're in love with them But it won't mean anything at all But that's not your fault Life's funny like that You lose one thing, get another one back You thought you knew, but it wasn't a fact No, them your whole life, but it was all an act There's no me of ways you could go a hundred days without really doing anything and still have the right to say i'm so incredible oh yeah i'm lovable because it's not a love performance no there's nothing that you want i'm so hey guys i'm back from my work and i've made myself a cup of tea this is ginger lemon tea ginger and lime or ginger and lemon ginger and lime by kericho gold i love it so much and because i'm feeling a little sore my throat is feeling a little sore i want to have some tea to help with that and i love my cup i love this cup that i got as a gift from my friend hi friend my friend bought me this cup because she said she knows that i love tea and i love flowers so it's a good mix of the things that i love anyway i'll sit and have my tea as i come down from the walk it's been a whole hour by the way i left at around 5 30 
and it's now 6 39 so that was a really good walk yeah it was a really good walk so i'll finish my tea and then we can go tidy up the kitchen and that will be it then tomorrow we go and get our hair done i feel like i am in shambles <laughs> literally i feel like my hair is not looking cute my nails mm -mm. I, I just want a new look i want to pamper myself i want to fix i want to put myself back together so tomorrow is a really good day to go and have that done so yeah let me enjoy my tea i will catch you guys in the kitchen for some organizing say anything but it could mean everything cause you said it to the right person and they needed the compliment but isn't it sickening you can say you're alone with them but it won't mean anything at all but that's not your fault life's funny like that you lose one thing get another one back you thought you knew but it wasn't a fact no them your whole there's no meaning But like in the best of ways You could go a hundred days Without really doing anything And still have the right to say I'm so incredible Oh yeah, I'm lovable Cause it's not a love performance, no There's nothing that you owe I'm so feel no need to explain I'll say it all again You don't have to show them so frustrating can't take yourself out the equation can't wait longer than your own patience can't wait longer than your own patience like you're here waiting until you're not can't remember what you forgot you can't take yourself out the equation life's funny like that you lose one thing get another one back you thought you know but it wasn't no fact no them your whole life there's no meaning But like in the best of ways You could go a hundred days Without really doing anything And still have the right to say I'm so incredible Never 
to go. I have this black dress that I got from Your Designs. I'll show you full length so that you can see how cute it looks like. And then I'm carrying a jacket. I'm carrying this leather jacket that I got from Leather Jacket Thrifts. 
leather thrift jacket i will tag the page here you can go and check them out they sell thrifted jackets this is a prime up one and it's really nice i really really love this jacket it's lightweight but it's warm and then i have this brown tote bag that i got from bushik it's really cute and i love how sturdy it is to carry all my toiletries scarf snacks everything and umbrella it fits everything that i need out of home i actually even carry it when i need to carry my laptop because it's big enough to hold my laptop yeah so i'm ready to go i've made some tea I've made some tea to drink on my way there so and I've packed lunch well sort of brunch I'll have that much later so I like to carry things when I am going outside to the salon or whatever I try to carry my own things because of course to save money on lunches and also to try and eat healthier options because yeah I can't be out there just ordering things around yeah so my uber guy is here Hello? Morning. Morning. My Uber guy is here, so we should be on our way. Let's go get maintained. Let's go get our new hair, our new nails, a nice pedicure. Oh, I'm looking forward to that. I'm not feeling too good because I feel like I'm coming down with a cold, but I've carried some meds. I self-medicated I have some meds that I had uh, I always keep some meds in the house when you live alone you have to have a running pharmacy in your house <laughs> yeah so I have some meds that I got from home well from my brother because he's my personal doctor <laughs> yeah so I do have some meds and I've carried a few to have after I eat breakfast yeah and I'm ready to go let's see how this day goes I'm excited to have my hair locked again yeah so that it can grow even thicker and fuller than it is now and so that i can protect these edges yeah so let's go we need to carry the extra battery because we have to stay vlogging
hey guys first can we talk about the face lift the face lift that a new hairdo gives mm, elite anyway i'm back home it's past 8 p.m that has to be the longest longest maintenance day ever i got my nails done let me show you yay oh it's showing us orange i'll show you guys these nails in natural lighting it's giving brown because of the lights but it's like a dusty dark pink i'll show you guys tomorrow but yeah i got locks back and this time around i have a few highlights i got locks done but i'm going to share a reel by the time you're watching this vlog i'm sure the reel will have gone up this is 2 30 yeah but the two is more than the Patty. yeah so cute i love the shoulder length as i said i'm digging more shorter hair than longer hair so this is gonna be my look for the next eight months probably i'll have this for the rest of the year guys i love this size i love the size i love the length and i can style it up nicely in like a cute little bun i can do like nice styles we will see we'll see how we style it but yeah i love it it's totally painless i'm not feeling any kind of pain love it so much yeah so it's uh so late i need to get working and i will talk to you guys tomorrow to show you the nails properly and also show you my feet but yeah it's been a productive maintenance day i feel good i feel cute and yeah that's just about it let me go take a shower recharge organize the house i feel like i'm always organizing but i got a few things from carrefour that i need to organize just a few like items i think three or four items i need to put away i left my bedroom in a mess i need to organize it and then do some work because i didn't spend the whole day at home so i have a lot of piled work not a lot but yeah i do need to catch up with work i will talk to you guys tomorrow and we can continue with this vlog Everything I'm never do in real life I stepped into a room, told everyone to be quiet Cause I had something to say, blew everybody away Wear whatever I want Dressed in a gown, everybody's like Why, where you going, no one special Just going to the store I think I'd have it all, tell you why I'd be more Picking the plate, being a plate She is on a rule Never seen her like this Didn't think it existed, no truth She's not in a place, she'll get moody But don't mistake this girl for being me Cause these are dream rules This is someone else, I'm not myself, no, no mm -hmm. Cause these are dream rules This is someone else, I'm not myself Problems disappear. She could tell you the things you wanna hear. She could read your mind and that she could believe of a little lies to tell yourself a lie. Never get it wrong, it's always right. Making the play, being the play. She is on a rule. Never seen it like this. Didn't think it existed. No truth. She's not here to play, she'll get moody But don't mistake this girl for being me Cause these are dream rules This is someone else, I'm not myself, no, no mm -hmm. Cause these are dream rules This is someone else
my day yesterday was just another day i woke up feeling a little not too well i think i'm coming down with a cold but i do have some meds that i got when i went to get my nails and hair done so i've been taking the meds and yesterday i was not having it i had so much work to do so i decided to focus on that i didn't do much in the house and that's why i didn't vlog a lot yesterday but today today i want to do a proper reset for sure i want to clean the kitchen because it's a little messy so yeah i didn't get much done yesterday but at least i caught up with work i was lacking a little so i chose to focus on that and now i have a call one minute so i spent the day working and catching up with work which i managed to do because hey this week has just been a lot you know with maintenance and just trying to set up the month but today i want to finish everything so that i can have the weekend to rest and then next week now we can properly get into work mode yeah so today i want to clean the kitchen i have a lot of dishes to wash i also need to organize the space tidy up the living room i've tidied up the bedroom so it's perfectly clean and tidy the bathroom room is clean and tidy too the only place i need to pay attention to is the living room and the kitchen and then i also want to rush to town to go get the spritz for my hair for my locks by the way you guys saw them at night i'll show you nicely when i style them when i'm leaving the house yeah so i want to get the moisture splash spritz uh thing yeah the moisturizing mist they recommend at the salon i want to buy that and i also want to get coconut oil for my scalp yeah my scalp does well with coconut oil but also the rest of my hair and then pass by the supermarket grab a few things the last haul i did the last shopping i did is still very much going into this month and i don't think i will need to shop this month like heavy bulk shopping i have everything i need but i do need to stock up on some meats milk yogurt the fresh stuff tomatoes vegetables and the like so i'll pass by the supermarket and get that come back and probably make some yummy dinner for today i haven't cooked all week i've just been making breakfast but today i want like a hearty homemade meal so we will do that together and that will be it so yeah i just wanted to catch up with you and just you know update you guys on what's going on but yeah let's go get some cleaning done and then we'll go to town and once i'm back i'll share with you what i get hey bunnies so on this week's reflections, I am yet to get a name for this part of the videos that I have been doing. I have been sharing my reflections, but I did ask the people on Instagram to suggest a name. So you guys can also suggest a name for this reflections corner. But today I wanted to talk about hyper independence, especially for us girls and even more especially for us first girls or oldest daughters because oh child it's a lot it's a lot um growing up i was quite empowered of course in our generation we were taught to you know depend on yourself don't depend on any man go to school have a career make your money sort your bills out do all of that and i've done this since i was 20 21 so i have 10 years of experience of being a hyper independent girl and i'm not proud of that well to some extent i am but to some extent i'm not because now as an adult i feel like the reason i became so hyper independent it's because uh it wasn't because people told me that i needed to take care of myself and you know fend for myself and you know sort myself out but it's because i depended on people and they let me down so i had to learn how to depend on myself from a wounded heart place rather than an empowered you know place 
and i feel like this is a story for most of us this is something that you can relate to if you find or if you think you are hyper independent i know i am but over the last year or so i have worked so much to learn to ask for help to learn to rest in my femininity i am learning to let people take care of me which is really hard it's so hard letting people take care of you because it reminds me of people will take care of me and then at some point they will just let me down and now it's a cycle so i am learning to depend on people and trust that they won't let me down even though they still do but the part of me that has helped me heal my hyper independence or at least improve is just understanding that even if they let me down it doesn't mean anything about me it means a lot more about them and i don't need to take it personally and i can depend on the next person and i can count on the next person and it just shows their character more than it shows mine and it's okay because i do want to be a soft girl totally i want to be calm and cozy and soft and you know a relaxed girl a rested girl and for me softness is not about being slow and lazy and not doing much for me softness is having a life that is peaceful it's about having ease in things that i do be it work be it relationships i want easy things i am not lazy i work so hard but i want to have things easier and that meant then i needed to work on my hyper independence because if you are hyper independent then you are always doing 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 trying 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 and yeah it's sort of conflicting so yeah let me know down if you feel like you are hyper independent how are you coping what have you done well for me i've shared that i have tried to tap into my femininity more and it's really in the simple things like resting when i need to rest asking for help when i need some help it's you know having a routine taking care of myself doing my pamper sessions cooking myself nice meals reading self-help books cultivating hobbies that fill my soul all those things have helped me come back to the core of who i am a feminine soft girl and i honestly want to keep cultivating that and i hope you are able to so today i didn't want to speak for so long my voice is a little hazy forgive that i think i'm coming down with a cold but yeah i still wanted to talk about that topic so let me know in the comments what you think about hyper independence and what you've done or what you intend to do to heal that part of you and if you've already done it let us know what worked for you i'm sure the galleys could use some help yeah so to soft relaxed rested queens
Feels like the first time Throw away all my pride Don't wanna say I love you first But holding it in just might make me burst Love in the open Daydreaming, hoping Melting in heart Leave new worlds Whispering winds Bring the remembrance That you're my girl No shame No games I wanna Hey guys! I'm ready to go grocery shopping I look so cute I look so cute Thanks <laughs> But anyway, it's so late It's already 3pm And I haven't left the house and I want to be back before 5 p.m. so that I don't catch the rush hour traffic. And today being Friday, it might be too much. So yeah, so I'm ready to go. I have the Joanna K Cosmetics Limuru lipstick, matte lipstick. I like it. It's very lightweight, feels great, and it doesn't come off. Well, if I eat, it might come off, but yeah i'm just going grocery shopping and i also have some mascara and a little eyeliner i've styled my hair in like a tiny bun at the back with some on the side also and it looks great looks cute so i just want to go get my bags and go grocery shopping I'm feeling so tired already because cleaning, cleaning, cleaning is not an easy thing. The kitchen took me quite some time so I'm feeling a little exhausted and I still have some work to do. So I want to go rush, get everything I need to get and then once I'm back I will share with you what I get and then we can organize that in the fridge, in the pantry. We will see if I'll manage to cook to be honest. I'm not sure I'll be able to cook but let's let's see. Maybe once I come back I might be feeling a little over ambitious <laughs> and try to cook something but we will see. So let me get my things. I have my two sandals here that I thrifted a very very long time ago and this cute little bag i call this my grocery shopping bag because it's tiny i just carry let me show you what i carry just carry some chewing gum i also have some intimate wipes these are intimate wipes and these are regular wipes and then i have a tiny mirror and then i have some pocket tissues and the lipstick i'm wearing and that's it that should be enough when i'm going away for a while maybe like the whole day my bag usually has more toiletries like extra perfume uh lip glosses and pens and notebooks and all that but since i'm just going grocery shopping i don't need much and it's a tiny cute little bag fits everything and i can carry it cross body it was a gift by my friend for my birthday so it's really really cute just need to carry the soap cross body cross body like so that i'm able to push the cut and grab things so yeah let me go grocery shopping i'll come back and share with you what i get and yeah we can organize that and see if we're gonna cook mm -hmm. bye to share with you what i've gotten today i will start with a package here that i have collected from one of us 
so she bought some rugs from the neutral bedroom i'm going to tag them here they've actually sent me a rug before that i have i shared on this channel maybe i did when i was styling my entryway they sell secondhand rugs and soft furnishings for your home so this lady bought two rugs from them but they are kind of small for her space she asked if she could send them to me and i was like it's fine you can send them to me i might use them and if not i can pass them on to some of you maybe we can have a giveaway i'll see i'll decide kind of similar to the one i have in my entryway so here's the first rug in fact this looks like the one i have the pattern is a little different but it's nice and it's a long runner this is really really nice and really cute i love this boho vibe so so much so this is the first one it's folded into two so this is how big it is let me show you nicely this is how it looks like so it looks more like the one i have but it's a different pattern for sure and then there's a second one maybe it's the same design i think it is yeah it's the same design so i might have to give one away to one of you right should i do a giveaway oh this one is shorter this one is smaller the other one is longer but it's really really cute love it so much i will update here maybe in the next vlog but you can follow me on instagram to see if i do a giveaway and when i do you'll definitely know moving on to the haul i went to best lady to get this moisture splash let me share with you I went to buy this moisture splash it's recommended for locks and it's a nice uh, product to maintain your artificial lock it was recommended to me by danielle's dreadlocks where i got my locks and yeah he told me i can look for it there and i can use it to spritz on my hair to keep it moisturized yeah so it was 730 and that has gone up quite well because this these things used to be like 300 400 500 but i bought this specific one for 730 and it's the styling dreads brand so i think it's good i think it's good i love how it smells because they used one of these on my locks when i got them installed so i'll see about that then now moving on to the haul i went to quick mart and i bought a few essentials mostly food because that's all we do here we just buy food work for food and just eat food <laughs> so i stocked up on the few things that i have missing in my fridge mostly and maybe pantry because i have the rest of i have most of the things the last haul was really big so i didn't need to buy a lot of things but yeah i got these spring rolls these are spring rolls from this brand a a l yeah al's kitchen they are usually in the freezer section i love them so much they are really yummy really tiny but really yummy and then i got beef on bone these are beef chunks with a little bone so i usually buy a bigger chunk and then i ask them to divide it for me by two so that i can store them separately and i can cook them separately beef is my favorite meat by the way if you don't know i love beef it's always the first one to be done from the freezer i have a lot of chicken in the freezer but beef i have none i've eaten all my beef yeah so i had to buy some beef to push me maybe the next two weeks yeah and then i got some chicken breast this i will use tonight but i have another batch of it i might use that one and store this so that you know i can use the earlier one before and then i also got some chicken wings today they were on offer so all of these were only 340 yeah all of these were only 340 a good deal if you ask me these are like 12 they were like 12 chicken wings i love chicken wings so much i'll definitely have this over the weekend and yeah i might share the recipe in the next vlog we will see but yeah that's all the meat i got today everything else i have um i have leftover meat from the last haul so i should be okay and then moving on to more items i got the ginger lemon tea by kericho gold i love it so much and i don't sweeten it it's just nice and warm and cozy and now that it's getting rainy and colder this will definitely come in handy so i had the last tea bag yesterday and i had to remember to buy this today and then i have a new favorite 
green tea and lemon this tastes amazing i love green tea in the morning especially when i am fasting i have been slacking with my intermittent fasting this month but yeah it's from easter to everything that was happening in march i kind of slacked but i want to get back to it so i got some green tea to have when i am fasting i have plain green tea so i can take that when i'm fasting yeah and then still on tea because tea is my favorite beverage well after water or before water i think i love both the same way but i love tea so much and i love the kiricho gold black tea these are the round tea bags i like the ones that don't have a string especially for my black tea because i like to keep the tea bag in my cup until the last drop i got some snacks these are floydy's salted butter flavored popcorn this is my favorite flavor from them i bought these two to have for movie night tonight today is friday and we're gonna have a movie night so yeah i have some stuff for movie night and then i met a lady at the supermarket that was promoting fini this brand fini it's a candy brand and i love i love this sour little mix it has like different mixes of sweets so she was promoting the brand and she had a few other candy to to give customers so i sampled and she's a subscriber hi babe thank you so much for you know the vibes she was so sweet she gave me so much sweets guys i have eaten sweets <laughs> i was shopping while eating sweets but anyway i bought this small one to promote her and to you know because i know these guys they i know they track they track maybe the sales of the brand if you're promoting a specific brand so i got this little bag of candy to just support her because she supports me too right and then i got cortex panty liners and then i got some dark chocolate pms week is coming next week i had to make sure i am sorted so i got some chocolate because i know i'll start craving it soon and then i got some basil this is fresh basil mine dried i forgot to give it water and it dried so now i'm back to buying basil i want to make tomato basil chicken pasta chicken tomato basil pasta and i will share it i know i had mentioned that i'm not sure if we're gonna cook but i think i still have some time for that what's the time you see it's currently 5 12 so i will rest a bit and then we can cook i will make this and it's a quick dish so it shouldn't take me so much time to prepare and i also want to share the recipe with you i think i had shared earlier on maybe last year but i didn't get to, to show you i didn't get to show you guys the recipe so today we're gonna cook some basil tomato chicken pasta hey the least the least and then i got some natural yogurt i bought this for mostly for cooking but also to eat with fruit to bake muffins i have some bananas there i know they are going to get overripe so i might need to use some yogurt and bananas to make some muffins maybe the next vlog the next vlog looks like we're gonna cook because yeah getting cozy and when it gets cozy for me i throw down in the kitchen i got my usual yogurt the bio foods berry cocktail this time around i bought this big tub because i realized i take the yogurt in smaller portions than the tiniest portion they have i know they have a smaller one but it doesn't make economical sense to buy the tiny one that babies have i bought this one to keep in case i need to go out of the house and i need a snack i can carry this but if i'm in the house and i'm making my own fruit salad or just snacking on some yogurt i can get from this tub it makes sense yeah and the price difference was not much buying the smaller tubs or the bigger tub but i wanted to buy this one to just chot out when i need to eat some yogurt and then i got some cooking cream to make with uh chicken maybe sometime next week i want to make some butter chicken i also want to yeah just for cooking basically yeah that's why i bought it and then i got some coconut oil for my scalp and my hair too my hair loves coconut oil i've been 
sampling different types of oil and I keep going back to coconut oil. My hair absorbs coconut oil better. So I bought this small one to moisturize the hair after spritzing with this. I really want to be intentional this time around with my locks. I want to make sure I keep them super, super moisturized and clean. And because I wash my locks from home a lot of times, sometimes even weekly, I need to have the right products to reintroduce moisture into them. I'll probably share a wash day routine soon when I'm washing the locks and how that whole process looks like. But it's super simple, but yeah, it can be complex. It can be complex, but I will share soon. And then I got some macadamia nuts. Imagine I bought these nuts the other day and have already eaten them. So this is how much I love these nuts. I get this one by Natishland. They come with a little baby and it's 270 for that. And then I got four packs of milk. I usually get the Daima whole milk. I love it for my tea, pancakes and the like. So let me pack these things away so that I can share with you the other bag and my last bag. Today I didn't buy a lot of things. I've tried, but I didn't need a lot here yeah, because I just shopped last week. I'm okay. So that bag is done. Onto this bag, I have some passion fruit. Quick Match usually packs these fruits in their vegetable fruit section. And these passions are 160 bob. They are super, super ripe. When they are purple, they are super ripe. I can't wait to eat these. And then I also got some tree tomato. This is one of my favorite fruits. This whole batch is 100 bob. They are usually, oh, I think one has come out. <laughs> they usually sell for for 50 even at the market so i just get them from quickmart and then i got some dania you can never have enough of that i got some spinach to have with ugali and beef or maybe rice and something i got tomatoes i never have enough tomatoes in this house so i had to buy but i bought some that are not super super ripe so that i can keep them i still have some tomatoes going and then the kikuyu in me had to get a cabbage <laughs> <laughs> the kikoi in me had to buy a cabbage but really i love cabbage and i love making it my own way there's a way i make my cabbage and it slaps so i had to buy and also i'm trying to eat more vegetables i've hacked fruits i've hacked drinking water i've hacked eating protein but vegetables i'm struggling so i had to make sure i buy enough to just motivate me to cook them and eat them and then i got some sweet potato i've had so much wheat the last few days i don't want to see wheat anymore so i had to get some sweet potato for breakfast and then i got some lemons for kachumbari for tea for whatever you can use lemons for yeah i like this for kachumbari and i think that's it yeah that's it that's everything i bought today the haul was mainly fresh foods and things that you need to restock within the month and this should last me at least the next two weeks i don't need to go outside to shop maybe just getting vegetables once i finish those ones but yeah i have everything i need for the rest of april really i'll just maybe buy meat and the vegetables and i'm good but yeah so that's it i will pack these things wherever they need to go chill a bit watch something decompress a little and then much later we will go to the kitchen and make our tomato chicken basil pasta and i will share the recipe i think this is the last time i will be speaking this much i'll come back to sign off after cooking but i like that calming slow quiet cooking vlog <laughs> i like i like to not speak when i am cooking so that it's you know it's calming and it's and it's giving a vibe it's giving cozy home you know yeah so i will be back we will go cook and then that will be it so let's go pack these things away and i will talk to you when it's time to cook you got me dancing in a storm burning everything we know dressing up as firefighters you got me dancing in your store Or I'm looking like a breeze But really you're a forest fire You got me feeling uncomplicated Whatever happens is meant for us Pressing into all the situations Whatever happened we came there first Go a little wild is your personal expression Far over the line tell me we ain't something special Wrap me around your solar system, make me 
you'll be able to win this one. But she's somebody else in the making. First, she's just gotta stop all the faking, and she'll be there. But she's wondering if it's gonna feel like she's forever. Wondering if it's gonna feel like she's forever. She leaves her safe space. She leaves her safe space Wondering if it is forever Or is there some place that will make her feel better Make her feel better Then that's where she'll go She's wondering if it's gonna feel like she's forever Wondering if it's gonna feel like she's whenever She leaves her safe space She leaves her safe space Wondering if it is forever Or is there some place that will make her feel better Make her feel better Then that's where she'll go Talking to myself like someone's gonna respond I'm getting tired of myself cause I don't know what I want But I'm not out here on my, out here on my own Wondering if it is forever Or is there some place that'll make her feel better Make her feel better And that's where she'll go Hey guys, so my dinner is ready and I'm going to share the recipe in the description box if you want to go and try it. It's really simple, really quick. So this is what I'm going to have for dinner and as it cools off, I'll go and change and get cozy, remove my little makeup, do my evening skincare so that when I sit, I can just enjoy my dinner. Yeah, so that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. And if you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already subscribed. And make sure you turn on your post notifications so you don't miss any video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.